Good morning, our presenter and participants. Welcome to the virtual Vietiso International Convention 2021. On behalf of the organizing committee, we would like to thank you so much for your participation and contribution to our annual convention success. We are Yang Han and Lam Yang, the, pre the presentation's moderators. We are delighted to see all of you here in light of the virtual presence today, especially in this parallel live oral presentation. We do hope that all of you will be able to have some knowledgeable um, experience as takeaways following the talk. Um, before the presentation, there are a few considerations. In case you have any questions or concerns about the presentation, feel free to leave them in the chat box so that we can gather the questions for easy response in the five to 10 minute Q&A session. And now we warmly welcome Ms. Duyeng Fang in this uh, oral presentation, which is entitled Designing an Effective Blended Academic Writing Course on Canvas. Um, about our presenter, Ms. Duyeng Fang is a lecturer in the Faculty of Foreign Languages, Anyang University. She has worked at Anyang University for more than 10 years, ultimately gaining experience in teaching language skills, ESB courses, ELT methodology courses, and general English at a variety of levels. Her research interests include instructional technology in language teaching, applied linguistics, and TSON. Now welcome Ms. Duyeng Fang. Now the stage is yours. Thank you very much, Ms. Zeng and Ms. Uh, Tang, for a very, yeah, for a very support, uh, supporting me during the first days and until now. And welcome you all to my presentation. Uh, and as you can see that, yes. Right. And the title of my study is Designing an Effective Planning Academic Writing Course on Canvas. And um, my presentation uh, includes seven parts. First, I will begin to put the necessity of using a planning model to supplement academic courses. Then I explain why there is a need um, of a blended writing course and canvas. Next, I briefly uh, present the model and important consideration when setting up a writing course. After that, I will talk about data collection, uh, key results, and finding. Finally, I will give some recommendation and conclusion. And now let's begin with the first part. Um, the questions come to me uh, when we uh, when I teach writing courses is that why well, should teachers use the blended mode to supplement courses, uh, academic courses? Thus, as you all know, that uh, the student-centered learning approaches uh, add modern learning trend in education at different levels. They gain their popularity due to their emphasis on flexibility of learning uh, by taking into account learners' individual uh, differences in learning, their learning styles, learning habits, and learning space. In addition, academic courses at moment and higher education are uh, being afraid that no longer fit into the traditional mode of instruction because of the COVID-19. And um, these courses now include uh, various opportunity that fully happen online and or in some combination of face-to-face, -face, uh, plus revenue and online learning as well. Uh, should a combination may be known as hybrid blended, mixed mode courses, and these technology enhanced courses are now a major components of upload higher education in meeting learner challenges in the 21st century. So uh, besides, uh, blended learning is also believed to be an effective way that provides motivating, flexible, and learning environment and engage students meaningfully in the classroom and outside the classroom as well, according to River Skinner and Karan Manuva in 2015. I just mentioned about the necessity of creating many courses. And now uh, the next question is, 
why it is necessary to uh, to decide to decide uh, the various courses on my classroom, especially in writing skills courses. Um, I will tell you about uh, my situation. Uh, the reading and writing B1 course uh, is positioned in the second semester of the four year programs of the English language teachers education. And to complete the course, students must learn 10 units in 60 periods for the integrated skills as well as due to midterm text. And the uh, teachers have tried their best to cover most of the required contents. Some parts of the unit cannot be instructed directly in the classroom or uh, in the traditional classroom. So some of the content will be left for students to start study at home. Okay. Uh, also, teacher cannot cannot monitor the uh, monitor uh, the student um, clinical writing spaces. For example, writing uh, brainstorming, outlining, drafting, revising, and re rewriting states. Um, that's the reason why some students cannot uh, cope with, or they cannot catch or finally understand the instruction. And their writing assignment are left unchecked and giving feedback for the improvement. So in where so for that at that moment I recognize that um, I need to do something to change the situation, and after doing research on an effective way to have students improve their writing performance, I believe that collaborative writings becomes an an ideal solution. Now, I will move to the second point, why there is a need for a blended writing course on Canvas. Uh, in the blended writing course, uh, students will benefit uh, from the interaction during various writing stage with their classmates and the teacher. For example, in brainstorming up ideas as a rewriting activity, uh, students will be motivated to write uh, if it is done in a group and group planning and development will uh, engage students working uh, collaboratively to organize the content and discuss the, the pros and cons while making decisions. Moreover, through a collaborative writing, uh, students can increase the awareness of their own strengths and their weaknesses. They also have to uh, encourage student collective writing it is said that writing collaboratively can help students to have multiple uh, perspectives on the topic of writing. Uh, and uh, they can help them to develop or share ideas and knowledge easily among the group members. Through the process of peer review, students also develop writing ability should it direct organization and syntactic elements of the reading text. And the most important merit of collaborative writing is that it produces independent writers because they have acquired the important skills of self-editing and revising of their written work. In order to set up the blended writing course, I applied the constructivism and uh, conversation theories. According to the constructivism theory, uh, it is not the teacher, but the student who construct their own knowledge through their own experience and from the way that they participate in working with their group members. Students can develop their problem solving skills. They will active, active, uh, they actively participate in building and creating knowledge individually and socially. And the teaching role in this, in this situation is to help students, try to help students understand our interpret knowledge, guide them to refine their understanding, and correct any misconception or improve writing performance if students need or if necessary. The conversation theory in this case will be based on the discussion of learning system. It believes that the interaction or collaboration 
between student and teacher will play an important and essential role in the learning process. It focuses on the continued or ongoing interaction between student and teacher. And in this sense, uh, conversation theory of learning will fit into the constructed um, uh, framework since it emphasizes on the student is an active factor of the knowledge. In order to set up a writing course on campus, I think that there are seven steps that we need to consider. First, the teachers should understand the key function of Canvas in supporting their writing course. Second, teachers should design the course with measurable learning outcomes. And then, uh, teachers try to present information of writing activity in a variety of ways in order to engage and in encourage student participation. Uh, teacher uh, can break the information into uh, appropriate segments and remember to clarify the expectation at the start of the course and for each writing activity as well. And uh, remember, uh, teacher during the course, teacher try to promote active learning through different way, for example, that you can share files or uh, to uh, to uh, organize discussion for room for students to come, bear the student online or offline when they work on the topic on the assigned uh, in the side topic or side writing task. And lastly, um, teacher can use the discussion effectively in order to en enhance uh, student interactions inside and outside the classroom. Okay, here are the seven steps. Right. Now, I would like to tell you about uh, the writing stages and activity that teachers can employ in order to design the planning course. Hmm. There are certain stages as well. In stage number one, in the restate, Students can do online brainstorming discussion on the campus. And uh, the end of this uh, discussion, it has to help students to brainstorm ideas, uh, discuss the ideas, uh, make decisions, uh, and outline the idea to be wrapped in the next writing stage. Stage number two, drafting. Uh, students can join general class or traditional class to discuss the idea online with their peers and wrote the first draft. Step number three, reviewing. Uh, after the first draft, yeah. After the first draft, he posted on the book, uh, the book blogs in Canvas. Uh, so that you do be a review activity together. Okay. Uh, in step number four, a teacher will try to summarize the discussion. Uh, and then post it, and we will then post the discussion or the idea uh, onto the book blogs uh, to have students follow and give comments uh, and try, and then they will write the second drafts. Stay number five, teacher will read, review, and give feedback on the student's second draft, and this activity will be done online as well. Then, students will write their final drafts on the parrot in the novel class. It means that after considering the, the feedbacks of their peer, students will bring their papers into the classroom and then they will write the second one, the second draft with the, with the construction feedback from their friends. And finally, a student will publish the final form of paragraphs on the class notebook board and uh, as a motivation and for other students to read and learn together. And here are the seven states and activity that we can consider when designing um, a blended writing course. Right. Um, in order to discover, uh, to know about the effect of the writing course to, onto the student performance, 
I uh, employ three data collection instruments. The first instrument is teacher and learning diary. The, the, the aims of the activities were to note student learning progress and to encourage them to participate in the writing activity. The second tool is classroom observation. And this, this can be done online and in the normal classroom as well. And for classroom, the last observation, teacher understood what students were actually doing and then they can modify the instruction and offer helps socially or individually uh, if students have difficulty. And the class, uh, the last instrument tools is some structure interview. This were done, this were conducted to gather student feeling, experience, perception, and problems that they encounter throughout the course. Right. Now, we'd like you to show you some key results uh, of the effects of the blending course on the student writing performance. The data collected from the teacher and student diary and interview transcripts and observation uh, were analyzed, coded, and classified into several teams. Uh, the first team is related to student general perception of the blending writing course. Okay. Analysis of student responses to the interview regions and their responses in the learning diary revealed that uh, most of the students claim they have a positive perception and feelings toward the core design. Uh, and some students said that they, they like the new methods of learning and they feel really happy and more relaxed, comfortable flexible than studying in the traditional way. And their writing assignment was also read and given feedback timely and personally uh, into their peers, their last mate and the teacher. And the results corresponded with the reverse study of lessons, uh, Lee's, So and Lee and Atumazit. However, uh, some students told that they refer the traditional learning, traditional method of learning because they think the current method was so complicated and they need to spend much time uh, doing the required activity or the task given by the teacher. All right, so this, in terms of the second teams, they make a planning course on student writing performance. The results of the study revealed that constructivism and conversation theory has an impact effect on improving student performance. I think that there are two reasons. Uh, this can be admitted to two reasons, I think so. Firstly, we can, it is because the role of collaborative writing activity, um, it means that a thing to do activity organized online, uh, students have more chance to uh, observe or are trying to learn multiple writing skills and they can gain language knowledge more effectively than working individually in the traditional classroom. The second uh, reason is that thanks to the use of plenty of methods, uh, students can enhance their interactions and they can be highly motivated. They become more autonomous, autonomous and independent learners. Uh, that's the reason why the high, if it can be said that the high motivation and autonomy that led to better writing performance. It means student can, if student uh, study in a more relaxed uh, environment, they can feel more confident and they can work better. And this result corresponded with past study of Annette in 20, uh, 2003 and who's seen in 2015. Okay. Uh, with regard to feature affecting student writing performance, uh, the collective 
data revealed that a student had ample opportunity to collaborate, to do group work, and communicate with their peers throughout the course. They said they feel safe and they tend to encourage uh, each other when they are working with their group members. And students who observed, who observed also uh, revealed that they feel more comfortable and not stressed while doing planning writing activity because uh, there are many friends around and when they have any difficulty, they can share, uh, share the difficulty with their friends and they can help, uh, help them construct the new uh, or the, the activity, or side activity with, uh, with positive feeling. The writing, uh, writing, as we know that writing is a language skill that needs to be practiced much in order to be able to master. And this fact was expected by students that uh, even though they had to do a lot of acti activity or um, tasks in the writing course, but they felt okay and they felt that uh, these the activity were to help students to improve their writing ability and somehow they feel proud of, uh, proud of themselves because they could do it, they could make it, even though there are a lot of challenges during the course. Okay. And the third uh, key point is that we have to consider that students uh, said, uh, thanks to the course, students were able to write faster and more creative. Uh, in their writing tasks. Uh, Sorry, it is just a little reminder that uh, we are running out of time for the presentation. Yeah. Can you make it yeah. short? Yeah. Yes. yes, right. So I think that um, in general, the planning course created a learning atmosphere and provides students with online collaborative uh, opportunity. Uh, the activity not only helps students to meet with their peers, it changed uh, scaffolding virtually, and they also help students overcome writing apprehension. They are they would be able to complete the write, writing task in a shorter time than before. Okay, right. And finally, I would like to in, end my presentation by giving some recommendation. Uh, first, uh, firstly, so to effectively implement the course, both teacher and st student should familiarize with the design, key features, and function of activity of Canvas at the beginning uh, of the course through tutorials and video clips. Second, teachers should consider in choosing yeah, all right. Yes. Uh, in choosing appropriate model design and then plan writing activities in the normal and the online classes suitably so that students can follow the lesson as their expectation. Uh, third, uh, teachers should focus on helping students during the writing stay, especially peer review activities and providing timely feedback during the two or three weeks, the first two or three weeks. And uh, more importantly, mm -hmm. uh, teacher and student need to commit to uh, supportive and productive work throughout the course because uh, because we all know that uh, sometimes uh, both teacher and students were quite busy. There we have other tasks, we have other things to do uh, beside the writing course that we are uh, doing now. All right. All right. So I would like to conclude the presentation. Uh, in the presentation, I have mentioned about the need for a blended writing course to support student writing performance. I also talk about the constructivist and conversational theory that was used to base on the design of, of the course. And then I also mentioned about the planning. Uh, planning includes flexibility, personality, and interactivity between student and teacher and teacher and the among students together. And I think that in the future, if we, if I have more, uh, we have more time, or we can consider of integrating online writing activity with face-to-face -face learning for optimal results in learning in a course. And um, uh, 
uh, we can consider other functions or features of um, canvas to uh, to find the relationship between the uh, outcome courses and the online writing activity. All right. So this is the end of my presentation. So thank you very much for your listening. Uh -huh. Thank you very much for your wonderful presentation. And Mr. Mm -hmm. I received several questions from the chat box. And I yeah. think that everybody is very interested in this question. That's the um, uh, questions from Ms. Uh, Bun. How can we create a Canva account? And can you please show your real Canva course on the screen for everybody to see it? Yeah, so and we can, uh, as you know that, and uh, the uh, Canvas, uh, Canvas is um, a learning management system that teacher can use and student can use in order to create a classroom. And I think that it's free because we just uh, re, uh, we just create an account, and after that we can invite a student uh, to to the class in order to support them during the course of, of learning. Okay. Yes. Yes. Can you show your Canva course on the screen for everybody to see it? Oh yes. I just see. I wish. Yes. So just wait a second. It's this gift. I'm sorry, just wait a minute because a YouTube account at the moment and asset. <laughs> the other is killed. Um, actually, the, the canvas, the canvas system uh, is um, it currently is used at my university called Gohota. And uh, uh, teachers and students are encouraged to come there in order to, to take advantage of the amazing features of the course. But at the moment, so. So uh, uh, to save the time, maybe we will. Uh, Miss Ben, can you can yeah. you give leave us maybe, the email? Um, yes, I think that if you if you want to know more about the 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 operation or some kinds of activity that I have done at uh, at my class uh, my classes, and uh, you uh, I mean you may contact me and I will invite you to visit my online courses. On Canvas. Okay, I'm very sorry because this system usually uh, maybe a shut down because of a lot of students and teachers use at the same time. And at this moment, my use, my university conducting an online exam. Yeah, so we can have trouble in assessing the the classes. I'm very sorry about that. Now, Mr. Okay. can you time your email address into the chat box so that everybody who wants to connect yeah. to you knows? Yes, how to sure. Use it. I received one more, uh, three more answers from uh, Mr. Fang Yuk-chan, but I'm really sorry that uh, due to the limited time, we cannot uh, include all the questions into this uh, Q&A session. So, uh, uh, so sorry for that. And uh, you can email the presenter directly uh, so, uh, to uh, get more information about the, the, the issue of 
Yeah, and on behalf of the VFT Zone International Convention 2021, we would, uh, would like to wish you on the best with the productive day and meaningful rest of our virtual convention. Thank you so much for your participation and joining uh, with Ms. Tuyang and us for this session. Thank you and goodbye. And we have one more session a ways ahead um, mm. in five more minutes. Yeah, so uh, please welcome. <laughs> uh, so I would like to say thank you. And uh, join with us in the next uh, session. Thank you so much. Yes, thank you everyone. Thank you. Yes, I would like to read uh, Mr.